Hey guys, this is Robin, and today I have some old friends that I haven't seen in a long time. They are currently in this bag. This bag is like totally vintage cap from like the 1990s. It used to be my school bag. I think like my freshman or sophomore year is when I got it. I love this bag. It is amazing. And um, I've had some old friends living in here for a while. They were over in my storage unit and I brought them home because I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them all, but I figured it would be fun to do a video and say hi to them <laughs> at least one last time. Might get a little emotional. I'm not sure exactly who was in this bag and there's another crate. So this is going to be a two-parter video. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm just really excited because like I said, I haven't seen these guys in a long time. And the reason I had them is because I was sentimental and all that. And when I moved, I think I had brought these when I moved in here to my mom's house. Yes, I live with my mom, if you didn't know that. Penny and I do. Um, and I then I put them in storage because I just didn't have any place to put them. But they are all really special to me. And there's probably stories. And let's see if we can find out who they are here. So first up is this little guy who is, I don't know if he still works. He does! Oh my gosh. It is a little Winnie the Pooh bear. I don't know who made this. Um, it just says Mattel. Okay. So he's a Mattel Pooh bear. He was super soft and cute. And he sings the, the you know, up-down song. And he's just so cute. And I bought him, I think it was post-college. I was living in Connecticut, I think, when I bought him because he was just so cute and I loved him. So, yeah, I've been collecting toys and plushies for a very long time, guys. He is just so adorable. Oh, my goodness. I love that little Pooh Bear. He's so cute. Oh, oh my gosh. So, these are... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I haven't seen these guys in so long. This is a little Mickey and Minnie that Mickey's shorts are falling off. I believe my brother won these for me in Wildwood in either some kind of boardwalk game or the claw machine. But there was a pair of them and they're so cute. And the yellow ribbon is from the first Iraq War. <laughs> That's how long I've had these guys. They're just awesome. And they're actually still all in really good condition. Um, I used to take pretty good care of my animals. Oh, and here's one I love too. I don't remember if this was a gift or just if I bought him because he's cute. He's a little gorilla with a banana. And I think I got him at a Hallmark store, which is why I think that I bought him. He doesn't have a tag. Oh, he's really cute. <laughs> he's a little cutie. Oh, Penny is on the floor here, like looking up at me like, what do you mean? Who are these people? Oh, this is a random. Oh my gosh, this is from the circus. <gasps> Okay, so this is from, um, and I don't remember buying this or somebody else bought it for me. Greatest Show on Earth, Ringling Brothers, Barnum & Bailey Circus. This is now probably a big collector's item because they just closed the circus. Um, it's probably from the 90s. It just says Ringling, Ringling Brothers, Made in China. There's no year on here. Penny's going to get dog hair all over all these toys. Um, wow, that's an alarm going off. That is so funny. Ooh, that is a cool find. Penny is sniffing these guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So this is a, is it Tigger as Paul McCartney? Is that what this is? It's what it looks like, right? He's got the, that, um, that base and he's got the suit. Oh my goodness, these were from the Disney store, and they're like bean bags. I think it was like during the whole bean bag craze. It says it cost $8 in the U.S., $9 in Canada, $12 in Canada. Um, based on Winnie the Pooh. Let's see if there's a year. No year on here, but wow, that is really cool. Now, I'm a big Beatles fan, so that is cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because look, here's another one. There's Piglet. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. That is awesome. I forgot about these. Oh, oh my goodness. These are like serious treasures, you guys. Okay, this is another one that my brother won for me. This is Mr. Frog. I think he won this at Wildwood as well. Um, 
And he has been a very good friend. I used to sleep with him in college. He was my buddy. <laughs> I had a picture of Mr. Frog like all tucked in, like in bed one time. And I don't know why, but that's just what I named him, Mr. Frog. He was always a very good friend to me. I love this guy. Oh my gosh, that makes me want to cry seeing him. Then we have, oh, this is cool. Here is my R. This is a pillow. This is a Rutgers pillow. Also an R for Robin, so that's cool. This is going to stay on the couch, I think. I love pillows. That is so cool. Oh, no, Kermy. Oh, this one's really cute. This is made by Applause. There's no gears on this thing. That would be really cool. And his, he was like all bendable, so I believe I used to have him hanging off of stuff all the time. That is so cool. Not sure when I got him. Not sure, but I know I definitely used to have him hanging off shelves and stuff. Oh my gosh. Oh, who's this guy? Is this an FAO Schwartz dog? Yes, it is. This is the FAO Schwartz puppy. Oh my gosh, I don't even remember having him, but I guess I did. And I don't, I don't know if they still make these. Um, they do, I think, have them at Toys R Us, but you can't get them at FAO in New York anymore because it's not there. Wow, some of these are really collectible. Who's this guy? Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, this is a Shamu. This is from SeaWorld, but I believe we got it. It was not from SeaWorld. Um, a friend of mine gave this to me, and I just had him in my collection for, some, for a while. That is pretty cool. This is Shamu. I'm not particularly sentimental about that one, but so cool. Oh, oh, oh! Oh my gosh! It is Eeyore as Ringo. That is really cool. That is awesome. Oh my gosh, I forgot all about these. I wonder where I... I, I used to have a cabinet, a display, like a big china closet, where I had like a whole Beatles... Um, collection all the stuff I got from eBay and from different conventions and they were probably in that shelf too oh my gosh oh here's squirt from finding Nemo I don't know if this one was from the Disney store yep yeah, from the Disney store Tommy um, got $12.50 now I always get yelled at for leaving tags on but see this <laughs> this is why I leave them on I don't know I just do He's in really nice condition too. He's got really cool, like these are like painted on. He's really, really nice looking. I don't know what year Finding Nemo came out. So he's probably more recent than, than I thought. Um, and here's <laughs> the Pooh Bear. I think Pooh is like the John Lennon of the group. <laughs> these are so funny. I did not, you like I forgot all about those guys. That is just amazing. And let's see what else I have in here. Oh my goodness, I have some really cool things. This is one I absolutely love. This is my Eeyore. He used to actually live on this couch, on the arm of the couch. And I would just pet him. And he is super soft and his tail comes off. He's also from the Disney store. Um, but I don't have his tag on. My sister used to work in the Disney store at one point, so we got a discount. It was terrible because she just spent all her money in the Disney store. But I think when she was in college, she worked there for a little bit. Um, he's looking a little disheveled. He's so cute. He might go upstairs. I have a bunch of plushies on my bed and he might go hang out with them. And, oh, he's so cute. Oh, <laughs> I've missed it. Oh, I love plushies. And this one is just, oh, I forgot I had this guy too. He's so awesome. It is Grover. It's one of the Macy's Grovers, and this is 2004. That is amazing. So, you know, Macy's has a special um, character every year, usually tied to whatever the theme for the new balloon is, and that was this Grover. And I think somebody, I think my sister gave him to me, and she got one for me. Oh my gosh, he is just super soft, and like his fur is just amazingly, amazingly soft. Did it say what year? Oh, yeah, I said 2004. So, that was post-college. Where was I living in 2004, Penny? I was living here in Jersey. <laughs> he is in really nice condition. Like, he's super soft and plushy and just, like, really vibrant blue. Wow. It's funny because none of these toys have dog hair on them yet. But they probably will soon. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> this was just so amazing to rediscover 
these really old friends. I have missed them so much. I didn't even realize how much I've missed some of them. Especially like my Grover and Eeyore and Mr. Frog. <laughs> I know I am a grown up lady, but I love my toys. They are good friends. <laughs> Penny is just like, what are you talking about? Like Penny's like over here. There she is. So she's just like, you are so weird, mom. But I love them. Let me know what you think of my little haul today. Did you ever have any of these guys? I just, they're amazing. Oh my goodness. So I have another box coming up that I'm going to be sharing really soon. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you'll know when I post that video. It has even more vintage stuff than this. Like serious 80s awesomeness. I am just so excited to be reunited with my friends here. They are just so special to me and I love them. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and you can check out some of my other videos over here. And thanks for being awesome. Bye.